Hello everyone, I am the Insamnix viewer, your hockey analyst. Please subscribe to like my videos. I'm here to talk today about the blockbuster trade that happened in the NHL recently. Let's get started. Let me pull up a page actually. I was too lazy to write them down today. The Leafs have acquired star defenseman Dion Phaneuf, forward Frederick So Jostrom? Jostrom? Jostrom. That sounds better. Defenseman Keith Oli. Uli? I suck at pronouncing names. From the Calgary Flames. And exchange Calgary Flames. Sent Matt Stajan, Nicholas Hagman, Jamal Myers, and defenseman Ian White. So yep, they swapped people. I thought it was pretty good on both ends. Leaf probably got the better part of it because they got Dion for enough. And I will think that um, he will kind of awaken a little bit with the new team. So, pretty good job. I give it to Leafs a little bit of an edge, but it was good for both of them. I think both teams got what they want. And, for love of fuck, would you people have easier names to pronounce? Fucking hey, dude. You guys did not make my job easy. Let me scroll down the page. Scroll down. Of course, it's not the trade I particularly want to talk about. The trade I want to talk about is the Leafs have acquired J.S. Shiger and they sent to the Ducks Vesa Toskala and Jason Blake. You may be thinking, wow, Ducks got shafted. Vesa Toskala blows balls and Jason Blake's old and has cancer. Let's not get too far ahead of yourself, people. Shiger has been struggling and Jason Blake is underrated. I think both teams got what they want. Leaves got someone to help push Gustav. 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 Oh, you know what I mean. Blow me, people. Gustav. Gustav. That's you. Okay, fuck you all. You know what I mean. Gustavson. That's probably about right. Leaves got. Leaves got J. S. Shigeru, who will probably take over the number one duties, and Gustav. Gustav. Oh, you know what I mean. We'll probably play the backup they might split. But now the Leafs should have a capable, steady netminder to kind of boost them. And the Ducks got in return Vesa Tosco. Wow, my butcher names tonight. <sighs> Anyways, you may be thinking Vesa Tosco blows. I don't believe so. I think the Leafs just blow major fucking ass as a whole. The Leafs just cave in and leave the NHL. And maybe go to the KHL because they suck that badly. But Vesa Toskala will be do better on a better defensive team. They're not much better, but better, good enough, I should say, that to see an improvement. He should be motivated. So it'll be a little weird seeing Vesa Toskala in a Ducks uniform, but it'll. I think he'll do pretty good. I think Vesa Toskala will have a little bit of a resurgence, and he got what they needed. Jonas Hill got the four-year extension for eighteen million, for I pedal, four point five million a year. And then he got um, Vesa Toskala. Good backup who can probably play, who play some games, but not take over the starting job. More than likely. J.S. Shiger, I definitely think, will have a big resurgence. I don't know if his numbers will quite show his actual good plays, just because when you play in the Leafs, you know that you, you get peppered and they have shitty defense. and. Leafs really don't give a shit about their defense. No matter how much Brian Burke he'll bring in people, hopefully this will work. But before the trade, they were sloppy and they left their goaltender out to dry many times. I I mean, Vesta Tosla played bad at the start of the season, but I really don't think he was the downfall for the Maple Leafs. I think the Maple Leafs were the downfall for the Maple Leafs. So J.S. Jaguar should face more shots, but Jaguar can play good. 2003 won game from Steel in the, the Cup. And I, if Ducks would have played, and um, if the, the Devils would have played the, um, the Ducks earlier in 03, like say in the Western Conference Finals, Ducks would have beat their ass. They just got lucky the Ducks cooled off a little bit. It's not like the Devils were actually the better team in that series. The Ducks cooled off and it showed a little bit. Anyways, 2003 won game from Steel in it. 2006, good team, almost won it. 2007, won championship. So, um, Ducks, don't just forget about Shakir. He may have struggled this season, but make sure you guys say thank you.
because you guys owe a cup to him. He was a hell of a goalie, and I'm glad that he has a new place and he'll get a starting, should have a starting job, and everything should go good for him. I'm hoping resurgence. But I thought overall every team made the trades they needed to. I'll recap the team's trade in case I fucked up by saying it. The Leafs have acquired defenseman Dion Phaneuf, forward Frederick J Jostrom, defenseman Keith Ali, and the Calgary Flames. They got Matt Stajan, Nicholas Hagman, Jamal Myers, and defenseman Ian White. So they swapped and got what they needed to. And then Ducks and Toronto, they swapped goalies. Leafs got J.S. Shiger and... Yeah, they got J.S. Aguirre, and Leafs traded Vesatoskala to back up Jonas Hiller, who just got the extension, and they also got forward, forward Jason Blake. So overall, every team got what they needed. This little kick in the nuts, a punch in the face when you need a smack a hoe. Sorry if I messed it up anything. I'm not perfect. I don't cut and edit these. I just make them. Sometimes I listen to music beforehand to get me a little motivated, get me pumped up. Uh, like I've listened to Kern Craft 3000 by, oh, I can't remember the name of that band now. They sing the old song that you hear in hockey games. I can't do it. Fuck you all. You know what? I know I messed up a lot, so eat me. Anyways, this has been the NHL Blockbuster Deals. This is a trade. If any more trades happen, I will post a video on it shortly. Please subscribe, sleep is for the week.